Hi, this is Nick and Matt, and we are going to be telling you about decimal place value and rounding. First, I am going to be telling you about decimal place value. Decimal place value is when you find out what number column a certain number is in. For example, some place value number columns are tenths, hundreds, and thousands. But to find the place value of a number, you have to count how far it is away from the decimal. Then you look at the chart that tells you the number columns. However far the number is from the decimal, you count on the chart, and whatever number column you land on, that is the decimal place value. An example of decimal place value is 8 decimal 3. In this problem, the 3 is in the tenths place, so we say 8 and 3 tenths. Another example is 95 decimal 9 six. In this problem, the sixth is in the hundredths place, so we say 95 and 96 hundredths. One last example of place value is 215 decimal 125. The five in this, the five is in the thousands, so we say 215 and 125 thousands. Next, I will tell you about decimal and rounding. When you look, when you round, there are many numbers you can round to. For example, nearest tenth, hundredth, thousand, and ten thousands, and those are only some of them. For example, if you round to the nearest tenth, and the number four decimal three four would be rounded to four decimal three. It's rounded to four decimal three. Underline the place value you want. That number will go up or stay. Look at the number to the right. If it is a five or more, the un if it is five or more, the underlined number goes up. If it is less than five, it stays the same. Then chop off all numbers to the right of the num underlined number. Underline the three. Look at the four. The four go says leave the three and chop off the rest, and their answer is four decimal three. Our last problem is 8.718. Round to the nearest hundredth. Underline the 1. Look at the 8. The 8 tells the 1 to go up, which will turn the 1 into a 2. Then chop off the rest, so our answer is 8.72. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed.